Welcome to Let's Play Forza Motorsport 4, Part 54. I think, yeah. And for this segment, I am going to be using my Seat Ibiza Cupra that I already own, but um, I downgraded the shit out of because it was very heavily upgraded. So it is now in its stock form, and we're going to take it to our next one make race. It is, of course, for the Seat, Seat Ibiza Cupra, and. Um, yeah. Very, very little upgrades to the uh, opponent cars, as there's only a 3 PI difference. In fact, I'm pretty sure they just put, like, I don't know, a flywheel on it and call it a day. Anyways, we're going to go to Catalonia Grand Prix circuit, so full circuit for three laps for this event. Let's go. Alrighty, here we go. My amp at the, on the grid. And this should be a fairly simple race if the PI difference is a, any indicator. Here we go. Didn't really get much of a run off the line, though. Which is a bit surprising. Oh, can I squeeze myself to the inside here as we approach turn one? A little early on the brakes. Got Russo to my right. Go Hanson to my left. And somehow made it out of there pretty well. Just, just very light contact. So, hooray. Oh, shit. Slow down a bit. Yeah, this orange looks pretty nice on this car. That's probably why I put it on there. I don't know. Oh, boy. We're just uh, going a little, a little wide there. Joining Weber up in the Larson lane. Not bad, not bad. Oh, carry such a little speed in the apex there. Go on, Evans. Ooh. Okay. He figured out I was there eventually, and gave me a little room there. Breaks. But I'm gonna get the exit run, so that's fine. Okay, two more to go. Both in laps and number of positions to gain. You want this orange on your GTR that you don't have? I think this orange probably looks better in, like, um, different light, but still looks nice. Alright, lap two. Let's just, uh, tuck in behind more here. Try to outbreak him. Oh, shit. Give me no room. Sounds like I'm doing a touring car race, judging by the engine sounds. Just like your typical touring car race. Which would be awesome. What is my dream car? Dodge Viper. The end. Probably an ACR Dodge Viper. Because the ACR is fucking amazing. So, you know, all dim track records, it broke. Dreams more like memes. Hush you. Everything is memes. Oh, 
Oh, Rossi, hello. There's a car to your left. Excuse me, sir. Don't appreciate that, my dude. I'm surprised we're doing the Grand Prix circuit for this race, but at the same time, I'm not complaining at all. This is like club circuit, short circuit, club circuit, Grand Prix circuit, fuck it. <laughs> Favorite concept car? I don't know. Ford GT90 comes to mind. Uh, Chrysler Mini 412 is pretty good. Is a TBR Speed 12 technically just a concept car? Fine, there's a Viper concept car. Oh, shut up, Q. The Dodge Copperhead, actually. That was a pretty cool one as well. Uh, I don't really have a favorite concept car. I never think about that. from Rossi and company here. Don't mind me. Final turn, coming to the line. Who's gonna win? It's neck and neck. Could be anyone. Oh God, it's me. I won. All right. So there we go. I win. Quite handily. And got a double level up for Sayat, so free upgrades from them now. Sweet. And that'll do it for this segment. So, our fifth event down, and spoiler alert, we're actually going to do a multi race championship or multi-race series in the next segment. Woo! So, uh, stay tuned for that. <laughs> 